Hey students, Shama Kapadia here. So back to work with the chapter number 5, Arithmetic Progression. Achha, ye chapter mein na, it's, it's a very chapter. This chapter has its roots in the 10th standard. Because in the 11th mein, um, ye chapter comes back in the form of sequences and series. There is a chapter in 11th called sequences and series. Which is going to be used in which it is So it is quite an important chapter, right? Alright, so arithmetic progression, ke pehle let's understand what do you mean by a sequence and what do you mean by a progression? Ke iska, ye shabd ka matlab kya hai? Yeah, so let's go ahead with that. So if I'm talking about a sequence, okay, sequence kya hai yaar? Sequence is a pattern, it is a set of numbers which follows a particular trend. Ek particular flow mein numbers aate rehte hai. Usko sequence bolte hai. Ek example leta hoon. 5, right, 7, 9, so on. This is the first example. Second example, 1, 7, ya yeah, 13, 19, that's it. Okay, third. 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, that's it. Last example, minus 2, minus 5, minus 8, minus 11 and so on. Okay, now tell me one thing, many either 4 examples likhe hai, right? 4 examples on the board, 4 sequence hai, a particular pattern hai, tum ko samaj to aya hoga, pehla wala is the easiest, 5, 7, 9, Tell me which would be the next number. Dekho, tum log nahi bola. Mainne to bola hi nahi na. Tum log ke man mein aa gaya hoga ke next number 11 hoga. Of course, because it is a particular pattern. Right? Second, ek hai, baut logo ko samaj aya hoga. Perhaps, 1, 7, 13, 19. Chhe chhe ka difference hai. 1 plus 6, 7 plus 6, 13 plus 6, 19 plus 6 and so on. It goes on. Next sequence, 2, 4, 8, 16, 32. 32 ke baad 64. Yeah. And minus 2, minus 5. 3, 3 ke gappings hai. Minus 8. Or 3. Minus 11. Or 3. Minus 14. So can I say, a sequence is nothing but a pattern or a sequence. It's, it's a, a set of numbers which are arranged in a particular manner. That's a sequence. Acha. Pehla. Or akhri jo sequence hai na, we call them as infinite sequences. Infinite means obviously khatam hi nahi hoga. Dot 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 dot, it keeps on continuing. And these two, which end, which terminate, they are called, they are said to be finite sequences. Acha, ye jo mene examples diye hai na, isme se teen examples are based on addition. These three. Kaise? 5 plus 2, 7 plus 2, 9 plus 2. Yeah, it's based on addition. 1 plus 6, 7 plus 6, 6 plus 13 and so on. Minus 2, minus 3. Minus 3, minus, minus 5, minus 3. Minus 8, minus 3. So can I say 1, 2 and 3 sequences are based on addition and subtraction. We call them as arithmetic progression. I'll, I'll come to it. Eight minute. Isko hum log AP bolte hai. The short form is, we also call this as a progression. Progression is a set of numbers in a particular order. Right? In a particular pattern. In a particular trend. In a particular flow. Usko progression hi bola jata hai. This is also AP. And this is also AP. But, ये जो तीसरा एग्जांपल है ना वो सीक्वेंस तो है प्रोग्रेशन है प्रोग्रेशन है क्योंकि वो पैटर्न है लेकिन एडिशन नहीं है सॉरी यार 4 2 plus 2 4 4 plus 2 छ 6 होता है एक थोड़ी होता है बट 4 upon 2 8 upon 4 16 upon 8 32 upon 16 जब मैं डिवाइड करता हूं इट्स अ कांस्टेंट we call this as a geometric progression. Jo apne syllabus mein nahi hai. We are only gonna function or work with arithmetic progression. Aise toh baut sare patterns hai dunia mein. 
there is something called as harmonic progression there is something called as arithmetic co geometric progression but nothing is there in our syllabus we are just going to talk about ap arithmetic progression what is so cool about the sequence ye jo sequence hai na jo maine diya hai dhyan se follow karo can i say higher term minus the consecutive lower term is a constant 7 minus 5 2 9 minus 7 2 11 minus 9 2 7 minus 1 6 13 minus 7 6 that means higher term minus the consecutive baju wala lower term hamesha fixed rahega aur jab bhi ye difference difference na higher minus lower jab ye difference constant rehta hai fixed rehta hai main bolunga that the sequence the progression is an arithmetic progression so if i'm talking about simple what is an ap bachcho ki language mein i can say higher term minus the consecutive lower term remains a constant and that constant is termed as named as common difference उसको कॉमन डिफरेंस बोला जाता है सो नाउ दिस इज द सिंपलेस्ट डेफिनेशन ऑफ एपी आगे वाला माइनस तुरंत पीछे वाला अगर सेम है पूरे सीक्वेंस में हम लोग उसको एपी बोलते हैं अच्छा एक एग्जांपल लेते हैं लेट्स टेक वन ऑफ दीज एग्जांपल्स ओनली ओके आई टेक दिस सेकंड एग्जांपल लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड सर्टेन टर्म्स व्हिच आर डिफाइंड सो 1 7 13 19 it goes on theek hai na let's say it goes on 6 6 ka gapping there right uh, so we have 25 31 37 uh, 43 49 55 61 on, chalo na 61 tak jaate hain theek hai it's this is a sequence <coughs> isme ye jo hai na isko main bolunga t1 or i will call it as a1 that that is meaning the meaning of it is it is the first term इसको पहला टर्म बोलते हैं इवन यूजुअली नहीं लिखता हूं आई कॉल इट एज सिंपली ए दिस इज सेट टू बी द सेकेंड टर्म टी टू और आई कैन कॉल इट एज ए टू दिस इज थर्ड टर्म दिस इज द फोर्थ टर्म ऑफ अ सीक्वेंस इधर यू कॉल इट एज टी फोर और ए फोर और ये जो है ना सिक्सटी वन वी कॉल इट एज द एंथ टर्म एंथ टर्म मतलब देखो जरूरी नहीं है कि वो लास्ट टर्म ही होगा देख देर इज अ चांस कि आगे भी ये कंटिन्यू होते जाए समझ रहा है आगे भी अगर मैं 79 तक खींच के गया उसको तो 61 वन इज नॉट द लास्ट टर्म इट इज सम टर्म इन द सीक्वेंस जिसको मैं एंथ टर्म बोलता हूं हा वो लास्ट टर्म हो सकता है हो सकता है बट वी प्रोनाउंस वी यूजली नेम इट एज द एंथ टर्म सो प्लीज रिमेंबर एंड ड्रिल इट इन योर ब्रेन्स एंथ टर्म विच इज टी एन और ए एन इट इज नॉट नेसेसरीली द लास्ट टर्म इट मे बी द लास्ट टर्म ऑफ द सीक्वेंस ये बट वी कॉल इट एज द एंथ टर्म सम टर्म अगर अगर वो लास्ट टर्म हुआ तो आई विल ऑल्सो कॉल इट एज एल स्पेशल नेम राइट सो आई कैन से दैट एंथ टर्म मे बी द लास्ट टर्म और मे नॉट बी द लास्ट टर्म बट इट इज सम सम टर्म in the sequence right all right so i will say that t2 minus t1 higher term minus lower term is a constant which is d jisko common difference bolte hai t3 minus t2 which is also d t4 minus t3 which is also d that means can i say t2 minus t1 is equals to t3 minus t2 is equals to t4 minus t3 they all are equal yes and we call them as common difference so which are the terms we we spoke about a1 bolo ya a bolo ya t1 bolo isko hum log bolenge first term of the sequence then we have something called as d which is also said to be common difference then we have something called as tn or you can also call it as an 
that is the nth term of the sequence and we have something like L which is definitely the last term of the sequence. So these are the few terms which are associated in this chapter which we need to learn. Hmm? Okay, is me hai na, pata hai tum ko kya? Suno. Can I say 1 plus 6 is 7? 7 plus 6 is 13. Malab, agar pehle term me common difference add kiya, to dusra term milega. Dusre term me common difference add kiya, to tisra term milega. Samaj raha hai kya? To suno na, if I am saying T1, isn't it A? A mala first term. But if I am saying the second term T2, you can also write it as A plus D. Hey na? Like, abhi to bola yaar. Second term hai. If you add common difference to the first term. Aray, demo, demo dena padta hai tum logko. Idhar agar A1 hai, mere example mein. So can I say 1 plus 6, 7 hua? Second term. T3. T3 mein kya karunga pata hai? Ye, jo 7 hai na, 7. T2, T2, T2. इसमें और D add करो, और D add करो. तो ये बन जाएगा A plus D plus D. A plus 2D. That is 1 plus 2 into 6. Wouldn't that be 13? और ही, ये मिला. Fourth term में A plus 3 times D add करो. That is 1 plus 3 into 6. 1 plus 18, 19. और ही, मिला है मिल मिल रहा है मेरे को ये पैटर्न समझ रहे हैं तुम लोग को हम जरा जरा आंख खोलो तो आंख खोलो तो जरा चेक दिस फ्रॉम योर व्हाट कैन यू क्लेम सी द पैटर्न द प्रोसेस इफ आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट टी टू इट इज ए प्लस बी प्रेसाइज वन डी इफ आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट टी थ्री इट इज ए प्लस टू डी इफ आई � it's A plus 3D. That means, जो इधर base पे है ना, base पे, which is Tn, nth term, देवा, मतलब जो इधर base पे है, D के बाजू में उसका एक कम हो जाता है. मैं इसे याद रख सकता हूँ, I can remember it this way, that if this is T9, wouldn't this be A plus 8D? If this is T12, wouldn't it be A plus 11D? If it is T27, wouldn't this be A plus 26D? It's always one less, right? So in general, ये बनता है मेरा पहला formula. So अगर मैं बोलता हूँ Tn, wouldn't it be A plus इसका एक कम n minus 1D? Yeah, this is my first formula. We call it as the formula of nth term, Tn. But आगे जाके मैं हर एक मैं एक ही बार formula लिखूँगा पूरे सम में. You need not write the formula again and again. You have to be quick. I'm again saying, अगर मैं तुम लोग को T10 पूछता हूँ, T10, you have to quickly say, sir, it is A plus 9D. एक कम कर देने का. Last time, if I'm asking you T33, A plus 32D, एक कम, याद रहेगा, याद, this is the formula of Tn, nth term, okay, I think uh, this much is sufficient to start with the first exercise and even the second exercise, third exercise में एक नया concept है, sum of n terms, और तब देखेंगे ना, पूरे chapter में खाली तीनी formula है, that's the beautiful part of it, one of the formula is this, there are two more formula which we will see after a long time. So just go through this. We're going to start with. I'm going to guess what you know. Solved example. Kari dete is pe. Fir we'll start with the exercise 5.1. Check. Mujhe diya hai. It's a given AP. Arithmetic progression hai. And one progression is given. Find the first term. And find the common difference. Thik hai. So if I'm talking about. Solved example 1. The sequence given to me is 3 by 2, 1 by 2, minus half and so on. 3 by 2, 1 by 2, minus 1 by 2, it goes on. This is called the first term. So A bolo ya T1 bolo ya A1 bolo. 
the first term is 3 by 2 common difference common difference is always higher minus the lower it's always going to come backwards backfire 1 by 2 minus 3 by 2 please don't say higher matlab 3 by 2 minus 1 by 2 sir 3 by 2 bada hai 1 by 2 chota hai aisa nahi hota hai second term minus the first term is the common difference so iska answer will be common lcm 2 upar aayega 1 minus 3 minus 2 upon 2 common difference is minus 1 Fine, so this is my first term and this is my common difference. That's it. Ho gaya sum, khatam, kya tha sum. Alright, um, second question. <clears throat> uh, which of the following list of numbers form AP? And if they form AP, write the next two terms also. Theek hai? Fair enough. Okay. So in the question, example number two mein, they have given four sub questions. I am not doing four. Solved example. Hai na? We'll do two of them. Okay, you tell me which one you want me to do. I think third and fourth. Yeah, tum log ke dimag mein majority wohi raha hoga. First to koi nahi bolega. Guarantee. So talking about solved example number three. Uh, minus two, two, minus two, two and so on. Let's check whether this is AP yes or no. तीन बार, तीन बार common difference लेने का rule है, तीन बार, come on, this is called T1, T2, T3, T4 and so on, you can also call it as A1, A2, A3, A4 and so on, they have, पूरे book में they have mentioned in terms of A, तो I will follow and stick to the textbook, come on, A2 minus A1, 2 minus of minus 2 which is 2 plus 2 next a3 minus a2 minus 2 which is a3 minus 2 answer is minus 4 sampla poona zala khatam the difference pehle ka difference 4 hai tujje ka difference is minus 4 the difference is not constant and guys, if the difference is not constant, it is not an AP. Sorry. Sorry, yaar. So, I will say it is not an arithmetic progression because you mentioned that A2 minus A1 is not equal to A3 minus A2. So, the difference is not constant. It cannot be an AP. The next one. Uh, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3. Ajeeb hai. 1, 1, 1. 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3, so on. This you can call it as the first term, second term, third term and fourth term. I have always taught four terms to do three times. Come on. A2 minus A1. 1 minus 1. 0. Next, A3 minus A2. 1 minus 1, 0, lovely, A4 minus A3, 2 minus 1, 1, game over, the difference throughout the sequence is not constant, so I will say it is not an arithmetic progression, because the difference should be constant in the entire sequence, it is not necessary that 2-3 times constant and then it will change in the next time, it is not so with this guys we complete we complete our solved examples and the concept number one go through it we are gonna exercise 5.1